Hey y'all, it's your girl Empress Cheryl. We're about to get into this Wisdom Wednesday reading, okay? Wisdom Wednesday reading. Okay, so this Wisdom Wednesday reading is pretty much trying to get messages from spirit, wise messages, messages that need to be heard, messages that are going to push you forward, you know what I'm saying, in life, what you need to take note of, okay? So these messages, um can cover many different things we're just gonna allow spirits to flow and see what you know what needs to be heard what needs to come out okay so with this particular reading though how i want to do is i'm going to use this sacred geometry deck as like the final message because i want to read the card or read messages from this card um or from the guidebook um, so actually how I'm going to do this though, is I'm going to select this card first, like a final card, and then we'll do, well, we're going to hold it to the end because what I feel like is this final card is just really going to, or the intention that I'm setting, let me say that the intention that I'm setting is for this final card, um, or this message that is going to come out what I'm going to read from the guidebook is going to essentially um wrap up the full message okay that was quick it's going to essentially wrap up like the full overall message of this reading okay so we have this card right here i'm gonna sit it here so let's get into it so i want to invite my spirit guys your spirit guys and the holy spirits come and protect us during this reading and give us clear and accurate insights on what words of wisdom need to be heard on this Wisdom Wednesday, on this wonderful Wednesday, on this Wellness Wednesday, on this whatever Wednesday you want this to be. And guess what? Even if you are watching this video and it is not on a Wednesday, the messages are still for you. <laughs> Wednesday is just when the video drops. Okay? All right, <laughs> so what needs to come out? Okay, enjoy new beginnings. Enjoy new beginnings. Embrace new beginnings. That's what I want to say. Embrace new beginnings. Welcome new beginnings. Socialize, celebrate, accept change. Okay, celebrate, socialize, change. Yes, enjoy new beginnings. Like jump into the new. Okay, embrace the new. Don't worry about the old. Don't worry about things of the past. Be willing to accept and embrace newness. Okay? That's what wanted to come out first. So that's what we're going with. All right. Um, whether this is a new home, new environment, new animals you know what i'm saying maybe a new ride you know what i'm saying maybe some of y'all get a new car so i'm just seeing this man riding on this horse um new adventures like whatever this is just be open to accepting newness be open to accepting something different like you know what i'm saying like maybe if you're wanting something different or you're wanting a change if you were you know what i'm saying asking spirits should you go for some type of change or whatever like enjoy new beginnings okay that's the first card that came out so that's the messages you needed to hear all right start something new celebrate embrace it be happy be ex be excited about it okay Take time out. Still rest, though. You know what I'm saying? Take your time to recharge. Take your time to rest. Maybe that's something new for you. Maybe you don't rest, okay? Maybe you're trying to take your time out to do that. Maybe you're trying to go to a spa. Um, You know what I'm saying? Get a massage. Maybe go to the pool. Go to sit in the sauna or something like that. But whatever it is, take your time out to do that. Take time out for yourself. Understand that rest is beneficial understand that rest is good understand that rest is also productive okay like that's something for um for you to embrace as well you know what i'm saying maybe put together some type of group to go to you know what i'm saying to go to the spa go to the pool go you know what i'm saying make some type of connection like that okay but whatever it is you need to understand that rest is good that you need to take some time out to rest 
Okay, what else? Words of wisdom for you. Answer the call, explore, travel, live, go and do things, explore, travel, live life. You know what I'm saying? Answer the call. Where where are you being called to? You know what I'm saying? Are you being called to go to a t particular place? Go that place, explore that place, see what is there, okay? See what's, you know what I'm saying? The reason why you're being called to go in that direction. You know what I'm saying? You won't know until you go, okay? That's what Spirit is saying. You won't know until you go, until you go and try it, okay? This could be um moving. Yeah, some of y'all might be moving for real. This could be moving because that new beginnings is initially what I got with those houses out there, like moving to a different place, a different environment. And then this travel card and explore, like if there's some place that you're trying to go, or you feel like you're being called to go somewhere, like go do it or go travel that place. Also, this may be significant to someone, but in both of these cards, I'm seeing spears as well as a spear in this man's hand. It's a spear in this woman's hand here as well. Um, these people look like they are protecting something, you know, or guarding something or whatever, you know, they in authority. I will say that. Okay. So what else? Oh, we're going to get the two that flipped over and then we're going to move <laughs> to another deck okay but we have spirit guys so i'm getting right here you're gonna need to um spirit is I, well one nudge i'm getting is your trust you need to trust in your spirit guys like like trust that you are being guided trust that you are being guided by spirit but i'm also getting that this may be um a nudge for you to like walk in your purpose this answer the call maybe a nudge for you to like walk in your purpose or see what that purpose is seek that out if you don't know what that is you know what i'm saying like seek out what it is but i'm getting more so you'll figure that out by following the guidance you know what i'm saying that you're given by paying attention to the signs by following the nudges like that's how you understand or that's how you get to know what your purpose is is by trying different things by going where you're prompted to go by seeing you know what i'm saying like opening your eyes up, opening your mind up to the direction that you are being pulled in. Okay. And then we also have this treat your body well, exercise, meditate, massage. Okay. Again, make sure you are taking care of your body. For some of you, this may be, um, the change that you need to do or the change that you need to embrace is actually taking care of your body, actually taking the time to meditate, actually taking the time to um, exercise, you know what I'm saying, with this massage thing as well. Some of y'all really need to just go and get a massage, okay? It is really what I'm feeling. Um, but yeah, I'm again yeah, more so like your um, spirit guides are pushing you towards some type of new beginning okay some type of new beginning and they're wanting you to answer the call okay so let's move on to this deck here what words of wisdom do you have spirit uh, additional words of wisdom faith in your dreams waxing crescent moon have faith in your dreams what is it that you want to do what is it that you have been desiring to do what is it that you feel like you know what i'm saying you're pushed in a direction 
to do <laughs> again like with this answer to call like you may want to travel like yeah there's something you want to travel you want to live you want to explore this this is the mindset that i'm getting for this okay and it's like how do you want to do that like i'm i'm guessing like spirit is trying to tell you like that you are able to do that like you have the ability to do that so you just need to follow follow the nudges follow the signs follow the direction that you are being um push towards in order to be able to do that because i'm getting more so like i'm getting the energy of like you are able to co-create you know what i'm saying like you are able to co-create with the universe so follow the nudges and it'll end up actually leading you to where you want it to be all along type feel okay is what i'm getting from that full moon surrender to the divine you're gonna have to surrender stop trying to control the situation stop trying to control everything you know what i'm saying in regards to this there's a need for you to surrender maybe there is too much control that you are trying to have in some type of situation in the unfolding of some type of situation when really what you need to do is surrender really what you need to do is answer the call really what you need to do is you know what i'm saying go somewhere get a massage take care of your body and then follow the signs and messages from your spirit guides and your angels and your ancestors and the divine that you are getting okay so let's just read this final card okay this final card here is number 55 the taurus number 55 the taurus okay so i'm gonna read the message from there in this guidebook to see what final messages you need to take with you okay so this card here is talking about magnetic energy okay it says the taurus is a piece of sacred geometry that when viewed as three-dimensional looks like a donut it is the primal shape of the universe the human heart has seven muscles that form a taurus it is the shape of earth's magnetic fields the smaller figure is a taurus vertex that was created as a crop formation in england in 1999 this card connects you to the energy fields of the earth and your heart connection to her. You may be feeling disconnected and alone. You may need a boost of unconditional love to aid in overcoming a difficult situation. Perhaps you could use a dose of grounding in the moment. Take an opportunity today to find a place in nature, no matter how small, and reconnect your energy with that of the planet. Use all your senses and really feel this magnetic connection. This is Mother Earth energy. It nurtures you and grounds it nurtures you and grounds in your being the love and stability you need to help you realize the transience of challenges and the magnificent miracles of life. All right, y'all. Those are the messages. Rest relax treat your body well and go get grounded go get grounded out in nature if that is what you have been being called to do to reconnect with mother earth because that was like one of the um wisdom that was a message on like a previous wisdom wednesday then that is what you need to do okay so those are the final messages surrender to the divine go get grounded reconnect with the heart of mother earth y'all take care and have a jazzy day